Cats or dogs? Cats. Instagram or Twitter? Oh, Instagram. Coley's cover drive or Barbara Azam's cover drive? Coley's cover drive. Not by much. They're both very, very beautiful cover drives. Ashwin in India or Anderson in England? Who is harder to face? Oh gosh, about to face Anderson, Anderson in England, and I faced maybe in the later in the year we're facing uh, Ashwin in India. So um, oh, I'm about to face both of them. So maybe I can let you know if we have a call at the end of the year, see see who was tougher. But again, they're obviously both incredible. So it's going to be yeah, there's no right answer there. Ross Taylor's tongue out celebration or Neil Wagner's wean popping celebration? Um, oh, I'll probably go, well, I shouldn't go near Waggers because a lot of the time when he gets his wickets, and I'm usually at short leg, he's the first guy to come in and bloody, he's, he's hitting the high fives hard, but I will go home because his passion is undeniable. So yeah, Neil Wagner. Mitch Stark's Yorkers or Lockie Ferguson's Yorkers? Lockie Ferguson, he's a good boy. Make your bed or leave it undone? Oh. Uh, in the hotel life at the moment, I'm leaving it undone. But when I'm at home, um, the wife makes me makes me do it. So, <laughs> depending where I am in the world, uh, tea or coffee? Coffee. Black or with sugar? Um, just a wee cappuccino for me. Yeah, until about two o'clock, and then Brandon afterwards Mar- maybe a English breakfast. Sorry, <laughs> tea in the coffee in the morning, tea, <laughs> okay. in, the, tea in the evening. Yeah. Brendan McCullum scoop or AB De Villiers scoop? Oh, seriously impressive, um, but probably Brendan's. Um, I do remember his very first game when he did it um, at Jade Stadium against Sean Tate. Just incredible, <laughs> 150 kilometres, and yeah, like I said, we spoke about his courage to do that. It was just scary. Straight drive or pull? Straight drive. <laughs> <laughs> Lara or Tendulkar? Oh, they're both. Yeah, obviously Sashin with what he's done, but Brian is a lefty as well. No, you can't choose between the two. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Good answer. Ronaldo or Messi? Or anyone else? Oh, I'm an Arsenal fan, so there's not not too many choices. Maybe Terry Henry back in the day. Um, yeah, yeah, it's not too many choices for the Arsenal boys, but I'll probably go uh, probably go Messi. I think I know the answer for the next, but Test or ODIs? Test grip. Rugby or golf? Love rugby, but golf, probably play more golf. So, yeah, we'll go with golf. Pavlova or Louis Cake? Pavlova. If you could travel back in time, would you face Richard Hadley or back with Martin Crowe? Oh, that's a great question. <laughs> um, I, don't think we, I think facing Richard Hadley would be pretty cool. Um, obviously, the record he's got. It's incredible. Um, and obviously a, a great Canterbury man um, where I'm from as well. So, yeah, to, to face him and most likely get out to him would be a, yeah, be an experience. Ken Williamson's beard or Tom Blundell's beard? Both very similar. Um, but I'll, I'll get around Tommy Blundell. Yeah, Tom Blundell's beard. Last three. Jimmy Neesham on the cricket pitch or Jimmy Neesham on Twitter? Oh, neither. Um, <laughs> I don't really see too much of his social media, but certainly, certainly on the field, he can. He's he's pretty entertaining. He's a good all-rounder. So, yeah, we'll go we'll go with on the field. Text or call? Cool. Lays on the beach or surf on the waves? Uh, I like the idea of surfing, but never done it. So I'm 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 on the beach at the moment.